loading simulator. Ah, there we go. There's the Gotham I love. City Hall, 8.32 p.m. 20, 32 hours. Hey, what are you? Oh, he did. You just killed that motherfucker. This is not your 61 Batman. Or 66. This is not Bang Pow Batman. This is I Kill You Dead Batman. These are bad, bad guys. Get it open. On it. Hey, you think he's gonna show? He'll bring the whole goddamn place down. Stay focused. We'll be out of here before anyone can stop us. Yeah, don't worry about the security guard. He's dead. Oh, Christ. I don't care if he's You guys should have knew better. You didn't hear the big boom? They're on the 52nd floor. I'm going in. Hey! Wait! Wait for backup! Don't need it. Back Take up. the stairs. I heard stories, you know. Sent three home in an ambulance. The rest in body bags. No wonder the cops want him dead. Hey, you ever seen him? Yeah, Gotham Zoo. Harvey Don't dead. Be flying animal. Batman. Me off. Ah! Batman's gonna kick your ass. Oh man. Bruce, you can't keep doing this. I have to. <laughs> no one else will. Every drop of blood, everything you've sacrificed. The city is safer now, but it's made you a target. And people will keep you in the crosshairs until you're shot out of the sky. I can handle, I can it. handle it. Oh, look at the blood. <laughs> Shit! What do you think did that? go! Whatever got in, don't let it get out. Oh. Don't you guys worry. It'll get out. First it's gonna bust your ass up. What do I do? What was that? Uh -huh. That was cool. Fuck out into the darkness. Yes. Ha ha. Back to back. Circle up. Who's next? Where you fucked up? <coughs> what the hell is this? Warm gas mask. How's that a thing? Pissed off! 
I know you're trying to create a myth, but be careful you don't turn into a monster. Sometimes you need a monster. Come on! Come on! Come on! I don't know what they did just now. Kick to the face! Punch. Oh, that was badass. And I just opened the door for him, though. Where's the Joker? Didn't your mother teach you to knock? Oh, bitch. Behind you, big boy. Huh? Yeah, that would have sucked. Payday. Damn, she's fast. You're kitty kitty. Intimidating, you're succeeding. Criminals are becoming afraid of you, so are the police. It's a scare tactic, Al. Just a performance. Batman! Come here, kitty kitty. Without a scratch. So far. Well, uh, not scared you. That doesn't belong to you. I was wondering if we'd cross paths. You broke the law. Here I am. <laughs> Cut the shit. The law. Don't tell me that's why you do all this. Squeeze into a suit, tie on a cape. Most people dressed up like that end up in Arkham. No one else will. I'm the only one who gets the job done. Yes. Sounds lonely. Gotta admit it. Sure, remember that. You give a good chase. One day you might actually catch me. Tonight. Don't you know not to corner a wild animal? It's dangerous. Bad kitty. And let's put you in a cage. Bring it, bat. I'll punch you in the face. I don't care if you're a woman. Fuck that up, bat. Fuck that up. Oh, there we go. He missed. Oh, oh, flip, flip out. It's getting kinky. Oh, I hit her! Ow! I always punch villainy in the face! What are you gonna do? Come on. Over here! You get this? Move us in closer! Of course the news people fuck it up. Oh, yeah. It's over. I wouldn't be so sure. Oh, well, that sucks. Ha <laughs> 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 ha! You ain't going nowhere. Bad kitty. Oh, ow! 
Oh, that was badass. Why go to all that trouble for this? Shit. A myth can't be killed. You, however, are flesh and blood. Oh, he got fucking God shot! Damn it! I said don't shoot him! No! Wait! Bad cop! Dickhead! Well, what's she gonna do? I know it! I. Okay. Whatever I just did. I just murder her. I'm gonna save you! Goggles go. Ugh. Guess I was wrong about you catching me. Not sure if it was for my sake or yours. Who put you up to this? Answer me or I let go. But you won't. You're not that kind of guy. Okay. I bet. <laughs> oh, she's not, he's not the only one who loves toys. She took it. Ha ha! Oh, you got scratched. Step yeah. out of the shadows and be Bruce Wayne tonight. Oh, that's a much harder fight. Don't let tombstones be your family legacy. Well then. Yeah. Time to save the city. Um, that, some of that rendering was kind of shitty right there. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. A humble district attorney like myself is not used to such a ringing endorsement. Oh. Even one who cut Gotham's crime rate in half. Is that what I think it is? It is. For too long, this Hard city has burned with corruption and greed under Mayor Hill's authority. But I promise you, a vote for Harvey Dent is a vote to finally put your foot down. And together, we can stamp out the fire and save our great city. There you go, nuts. If only Mr. Wayne, my campaign's largest backer, could have heard that applause, he would sh Well, there he is. Fashionable <laughs> and fashionably late, as always. Say hi, Bruce. Hi. I mean, hi. Enjoy drinking my wine. It's worth more than most of you. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. No, he's, he's kidding, everyone. <laughs> uh, no wine is that expensive. Thank you. Thank you again, everyone, for your unwavering support. Together, we will change Gotham. <laughs> Mr. <laughs> Wayne, thank you for opening your house to us. Now, I know this is the biggest mansion in Gotham, but I don't think you got lost on your way here. <laughs> Where were you? I know you prefer the brooding billionaire angle. So the sooner we make nice with the donors, the sooner everyone will leave you alone. Just wanted to make an entrance. Congratulations, you almost missed it. You are a pillar of this city and my campaign. I need you here, tuxedoed and shaking hands. No one came here tonight to see me. They want to see the Bruce Wayne, am I right? <laughs> and I can see him just fine from here. This shouldn't be painful. It's not a kidney stone. It's only a little face time with potential donors. Okay. Your face, specifically, with a mouth that's saying, Support Harvey Dent. Where the grease, <laughs> they're the wheels. And they're rolling in enough cash and votes to help make Gotham a place for families again. Ah, a little liquid courage before facing your adoring public? This'll help you too, Bruce. Once I've turned this city around as mayor, you'll be a hero for funding my campaign. Sure. Now all I need is a decent slogan. I'm terrible at those. It always makes me sound like a used car salesman. 
Which, for the record, I have not been since before law school. All right, all right, all right. How about, uh, a new face for Gotham? Hmm? Look at you. It's not half bad. <laughs> I'm gonna use that. Bruce, I meant what I said. Together, you and me, we change Gotham. A city free from crime, where children can play in the streets again. That's what I want too, Harvey, but you know how rough it is out there. We have to shake things up to make that happen. Well, we can start with a few hands, hmm? Come yeah, on. Yeah, sure. But I think shit's gonna go bad. It always does. Oh no, this guy's drinking straight from the bottle. Oz? Mr. Wayne, I'd like to introduce you to Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know these two. Hello, Bruce. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises, and her husband voted for Mayor Hill last time. I'll admit it, Mr. Wayne. I don't know Mr. Dent from a pothole on Main Street, but I trust <laughs> your family. If you believe in Dent, we believe in you. After all, whoever you support is a reflection on you. And we trust someone like you to lead this city to greatness. Well, thank you, but we're all here tonight because we want to make a difference, and that's what it's going to take. Yeah. Every single one of us. Not just me, not just Mr. Dent. Everyone. Right, right. Of course. Old they families like ours should flock together, you know. Like birds. You're preaching, dear. No, it's true. The Waynes and Zellerbachs are reminders of the golden age of Gotham. Uh, this city's luster faded years ago, Mr. Dent. Look at Gotham now. Murder in the streets, corruption in City Hall, that Cape Bat freak dealing out vigilante justice like Look it's the wild bitch. goddamn West. Oh, Bobby, regarding Golden Age, seems you're getting cranky in yours. There's always hope. Forgive me for being blunt, but one man can't save this city. And it's a dangerous mentality to think so. That's how you get creeps like this Batman. Harvey Dent is our best shot. Put him in a room with anyone for 15 minutes and that grin will win him over. He's gonna need more than that, son. Oh, it hasn't been 15 minutes yet, Bob. <laughs> You've still got time. Uh, don't worry, though. I am not doing this alone. And with Bruce's help, we're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Asylum with a state-of-the-art mental health facility to help Gotham's most at-risk individuals. It will be dedicated to Thomas and Martha Wayne oh, in the that's hopes nice. that their fate will never be repeated. After all your parents did for this city, oh, to be killed in a botched robbery in some alleyway, it was terrible. Are we going to see a Truly remake terrible. of that again? Yeah, a tragedy like that at such a young age it must have been crippling. If only that uh, deranged man had gotten the right treatment, maybe... Uh, well, I don't like to think about maybes. And I'm sure you don't either. Uh, yes, well, that was a long time ago. I've moved on. Of course. Of course. Together, we'll help the whole city move on. He does not look happy. <laughs> not saying I doubted you, but that went better than expected. It is a night of ringing endorsements. Oh, no. Oh, well, hello. Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicki hmm. Vale, not interested, and reporter for the Gotham Gazette. This is a private Fucking fundraiser, Miss vale. vale. No reporters allowed. Well, you don't mind if I stay and ask a few questions, do you, Mr. Wayne? Well, you can ask me whatever you want at the press, press conference, conference tomorrow. tomorrow. Actually, Actually, I'm, I'm here, here for Mr. Wayne. Tonight is strictly off the record. We can talk, but nothing gets written down. I'm okay with that. I was just hoping to see what makes Bruce Wayne tick. Hmm. This is quite the social event, Mr. Wayne. Oh, come on now. So formal. Call me Bruce. Well, Call me Bruce. Bruce, you've been going around pleasing everyone tonight. But... How are you doing? Hmm. You should enjoy your own party before all the champagne runs out. Everyone loves the host. You're king for a day. Just a day? <laughs> I would have guessed Bruce Wayne has that feeling year-round. <laughs> yeah, well, I take nights and weekends off. 
Mr. Wayne, you've you've got something on your collar. Um, is that blood? Maybe. Yeah. It looks like. Uh, actually, it's uh, it's lipstick. Well, no wonder you were late. Say no more. <laughs> Do excuse me, Master Bruce, but uh, another guest has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the bar. You may want to greet this one personally, sir. Oh, shit. It's Filoni. Carmine Falcone? Falcone. Is I'm the Dent this. campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything except being a businessman who loves this city. Excuse us, Miss Vale. Surprised I didn't get Falcone right. <laughs> and what kind of business do you think he's in? The one that controls enough votes to get me into City Hall. This that is the sounds... necessary evil of politics, Bruce. It's in the service of a better Gotham. Just sounds all evil. Not necessary. Look, at least hear him out before you kick him out. Falcone requested to speak with you directly. I don't like this, Harv, but I'm trusting you. Thank you, Bruce. Seriously. You know I have to pull every string I can to get elected. Yeah, well, just make sure this one doesn't hang you. Yep. A word of warning, Bruce? Play nice. Oh, no. Now I've been in the market for a new house. Decent walk up, sky high ceilings, plenty of room for my cars. I think I'll take it. Though the decor offends my eyes. <laughs> Man, all flash, no class. Let's talk privately, shall we? <laughs> hey, I like this guy. Ready to do business before we even introduce ourselves. But we'll get to that. Carmine Falcone, thank you for welcoming me into your home. Oh, shit. People are watching! You're a respectable man, I hear. I'm a respectable Gentlemen, man. Perhaps we'll all be more comfortable in the parlor. Follow me, if you will. That's why I won't touch you, motherfucker. You should know, Mr. Falcone, my analysts say we're raising triple with Mayor Hill at... They don't want to talk to you. You'll be fine out there, Harvey. I saw plenty of skirts to keep you busy for a few minutes. Harvey stays with us. A man's home is his castle. I respect that. <laughs> Seen and not heard. Whatever ah, you... Ah, what did I say? Ha! Being a dick. Mr. District Attorney here wants to make sure the rules are followed. But in my experience, there's the law, and there's doing what's right. You understand? And well, I'd rather see Harvey actually help this city instead of just say any will. Sing well, I would say you can uphold the law and still do what's right. To a point. No one gets remembered for staying in the middle. Uh, Mr. Falcone, I... No more warnings. I ain't here to chinwag about politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me indigestion. I got enough of that as is. What so, are you gonna do? Let's talk relationship. Chalk this for me. Be a pal. I can get Harvey the mayor's seat. Or I can pull it out from under him. Okay, imagine, this is me, and these are all my friends in Gotham. Hmm. The businesses, restaurants, clubs, docks, unions, politicians. If Harvey gets elected. That's why I came here tonight to your lovely home, hoping to make a new friend. One who can help Mr. Dent see the light, if need be. 
Between your businesses and mine, I bet we employ half the city. Oh, I'm everyone's friend. <laughs> Which means you're really no one's. Pick a lane before you have a head-on collision. You listen to me, kid. I know somewhere inside that tuxedo you understand this situation. Money gets money. The risks, the alliances, the hidden costs. Your father knew which hands to shake. Hmm. Did he? And which to break. Don't you dare talk about my father. You're Don't getting worked up over daddy. nothing. <laughs> Hell, I knew him longer than you did. People don't say no to me. I will, Not bitch. Long. I will slap you like a bad baby. Master Bruce, your guests are leaving. I recommend seeing them out. You wouldn't want to be rude. Thank you. Anyone Heed your butler's him? advice, kid. Oh, and I'm no longer interested in buying the house. The owner's a prick. And he's gonna get what's coming to him. Hmm. Batman!